क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोज फ्रॉम इकीडा हेलो स्टूडेंट सो इन दिस वीडियो we are going to understand how to find out the jacobian of implicit function so we have learned the concept of implicit function in the partial differentiation and now in the application of partial differentiation that is in jacobians we will learn how do we get the jacobian of such implicit function so guys if u v and w are the implicit function of x y and z now what does it mean so we know that if a function of u v w x y z is equal to 0 then such function is called as implicit function so if we have implicit function then the jacobian of the implicit function is given by this two formula so in the first formula is jacobian of u v w with respect to x y z and the second formula is exactly reverse of that that is jacobian of x y z with respect to u v w so what is the answer so whenever we want to find out the jacobian of u v w with respect to x y z then the formula is minus 1 raise to 3 so we can say it is negative itself then here will differentiate this three functions f1 f2 f3 now how we will get the f1 f2 f3 so here i have i said that it is fr uv w xyz where r is 1 to 3 so we'll be having three functions in the given question so we'll call the first function as f1 second as f2 and third is f3 so we'll find out the jacobian of f1 f2 f3 with respect to xyz by using the definition of jacobian and whatever answer that will come we'll divide that answer by the jacobian of f1 f2 f3 with respect to uv w so guys this is the formula to get the jacobian of uv w with respect to xyz now the question is how to remember this formula easily so that's very simple see here in the numerator you have uv w or i would say you are differentiating uv w with respect to x y z so if you are differentiating uv w then take that uv w in the denominator and you are differentiating with respect to x y z take it in the numerator now same logic i'll use over here so here i'm differentiating x y z with respect to uv w so i'll take this x y z in the denominator And this U V W in the numerator. So that is why the formula will be minus one cube. Then Jacobian of f one f two f three with respect to U V W divided by Jacobian of f one f two f three with respect to x y and z. So guys, this is the formula to find out the Jacobian of implicit function. Now I'll be using this formula in the coming numericals to get the solution. So I'm sure that you understood this video very well. So guys what you have to do is you just have to subscribe to ekida and share this video to many students or i would say share this video to your friends because if you share this video to your friend they will also understand the concept of jacobian of implicit function very well thank you very much